Hi everyone and Jashi Dele, welcome back to my channel. So, today we video the Nigi Tolo Dune Sewa Samsu, as you can see behind me. <laughs> it's a hot mess back there, but Nigi the summer Leore and the Ni Misangma Chulo Dune Chulo lockdown, the quarantine, that someone's do this and you know, everybody's trying to go outside, look their best because, you know, we've all been basically stuck in a cage for three months, so, you know, we want to look cute. <laughs> um, so when you get the video, just say what some so and it's so much to the outfit because the ideas they are to load the ideas to the and do searching it was right. And he thought that on a case in a nigi, uh, all right, Zara, Lela, Chinua, Indian, and Zara, uh, clothing store to load so what no longer, long as Lela Chira, and the Soho Layore, Nigi, so our last Lela Chisudi, Soho Redding, and Tamuya and a statue of Munda, uh, Brian Park, 42nd, a statue, and they do never dress for sure. So, if you want to choose the money, you can position the card in a visual merchandise. You can position the visual merchandise in a visual merchandise. You can gain the responsibility of the store. You can gain the sales. You can gain the responsibility of the store. 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 You can gain the responsibility I was able to interest and passion in this And I was able fashion designer and I was able to get a lot of money. I was able to get I was to so with that, with all that being said, I want to just jump right into today's video and um, hari niyegi outfit dun sangma summer chida outfit re ani niyegi ta specific order ni ro kamera idea ro jyo kani kyungo yeme na wudi ni ranzo chigya wo. So let's get started. So the first outfit that I'm going to start off with is the outfit that I have on right now. Which is basically a Tupac oversized graphic t shirt uh, paired with a high waisted chambray denim shorts with a bit of distressed detailing on the bottom, paired with my go to slippers for the summer, plain old black slippers with a bow tie on it, slip ons rather. And I also added a black belt going across just to give it a little bit more of a detailed look. I like this look because it's very simple and it's doable for honestly everybody's shape and type. Um, it's simple, it's comfortable, and it actually looks presentable. So this is this is one of my favorite go-to looks for the summer. Just a plain old denim shorts and graphic tape. So the second look is this high-waisted dark denim mom jeans paired with a gray cropped graphic t-shirt and here I'm also trying to place my faux leather or pleather clutch around my belt loop just to give it a more detailed look. Um, the bag is actually from Zara so it was the denim pants, the mom jeans and what I love about this outfit is that it's very simple yet somewhat fashionable and most importantly comfortable so I'm sure you guys can tell along the way comfort is key in my fashion book um, honestly fashion is what you make it so everybody has their own sense of fashion style but for me honestly I go with comfort rather than just like the end product so I have paired this whole outfit as you can see with this fanny pack of a belt and um, my dad's sneakers which are from Fila and they're actually very comfortable and as you can see the denim itself kind of has a bit of a stretch around the waistline so it gives me that relaxed and comfortable feel it doesn't constrict your body so you're good to wear this kind of like as an everyday look for the summer so the third look is basically a monochrome tone look I'm playing with the white, off-white, and beige colors here with this sleeveless beige graphic t-shirt that I've had probably since when I was in high school. And I paired that with these really cool linen trousers that I got from Urban Outfitters. And what I like about these pants is that one, it's very comfortable. And two, I really like these button details, these three giant buttons 
the buttons actually give the pants a lot of um, unique detailing with it being kind of like an ombre tone and just three giant buttons <laughs> alongside the waistline that serves no purpose really. So another fun idea just to play with the whole monochrome colors is to throw on this linen button down blouse, a very clean look, still playing with the whole beige, white, and off-white colors with a pop of um, copper and burgundy. The accessories that I've paired with this outfit is this crossbody copper slash burgundy tone um, boho bag and these lace-up leather Zara wedged sandals. These sandals also have this dual-colored sole, which plays really well with the whole outfit. And here comes my lovely, cute little niece, ready to play. So for the fourth look, I'm going to be wearing a paisley printed romper along with these black gladiator sandals. This look, actually you can pull it off just as is with a black crossbody bag going over it. Or if you want to Coachella it up a bit, you can pull it off with this suede studded cardigan that I have here that also has fringes, so a lot of detailing going on here. And apparently my niece does not like it, she's saying no, <laughs> as you can see. So this is another option for you all if um, you feel like the romper isn't cutting it. Um, you can pair it with this suede fringed cardigan and it gives it more of like a Coachella vibe, I think. Um, now she's playing with the fringes, so I think she likes the outfit now. So that kind of sums up this whole boho fringed vibe and it, this might not be appealing to everybody but it kind of works for me in my unique sense of style. So for the fifth look, I'm wearing a floral A-line midi dress that has small detailing such as the ruffles around the neckline and it has a deep V so it is a bit revealing. Um, there's an option to wear a t-shirt inside it if you prefer. And I paired this with the same gladiator shoes that I had on before. So this is just like a simple summer, you know, cute summer dress that you can wear um, to go out or to the park in. This is the sixth look, a fitted cropped plain white t-shirt. Over it I have paired a baby blue spaghetti strapped dress. The dress is a bodycon dress with a straight cut so it just kind of hugs your body in all the right places and also gives the dress itself a very nice flow. And with this outfit I paired the dad sneakers again so the all white female sneakers which is a bit worn out but it still works well with the outfit. So for the seventh look, I'm wearing a cheetah printed mustard blouse paired with a white high-waisted culotte. The cheetah printed blouse is actually a cropped blouse, but I just tied a knot in the bottom to make it a little bit more casual. I'm carrying a crossbody snake skin bag. This bag actually also works as a clutch if you put in the straps from the side. So to finish off the look, I'm wearing a leather studded loafer that I got from Zara a few years back. And this whole outfit is actually very multi-functional because you can wear it anywhere. You can wear it to your work, you can wear it to go shopping with your friends, you can also wear it to go have a nice dinner. So this is the 8th look and again it is a bit more casual and I am putting on my pleather fanny pack again. This denim actually saw it before, it's just another color so this is a grey dark grey washed um, mom jean here. High waisted mom jean and I've paired this with a distressed plaid button down shirt that is also cropped and overall I am wearing these lovely dad sneakers. I keep mentioning dad sneakers so no they're not really actually my dad's sneaker but you know that's what we refer to it as nowadays. Um, they're just my sneakers from Fila 
And this outfit, I really like it because again, it's comfortable, high-waisted anything I love because it kind of just like snuggles my body in all the right places and it is a perfect go-to outfit for me. So this is another fun look for the summer. I am wearing a off-the-shoulder white poplin crop top with this really cute ruffle detailing around the sleeves and I paired it with this high-waisted olive green 100% silk pants that I got from Zara at such a great price that I still can't believe it. And it's so soft that I love these pants so much. Um, I'm also carrying, again, as you can see, my snakeskin crossbody bag or clutch, whichever one you prefer. I'm wearing the braided slippers here with the outfit just to kind of complement the look and not to overdo it too much because the outfit itself is a little, um, has a lot of detailing so I kind of wanted to keep it simple with the shoes. This outfit honestly can just be worn to go out um, shopping in or even just to hang out with your friends. I feel like I've been saying that for most part of this video but it's just a cute simple summer outfit and I'm sure you can't go around wearing this anywhere. So just to keep with the off-the-shoulder theme, here I'm wearing a off-the-shoulder denim chambray dress. It is a sort of like a box cut so it's suitable for every body type and it also has these cute little pockets on the side that you really can't tell exist but it adds a lot of character to the dress. I also like these ruffles that go around the neckline and the sleeves and I happen to have another color in this, also a black one. This is the last look and this happens to be my 11th look so thank you so much for bearing with me thus far and here I'm wearing a t-shirt dress, a beige t-shirt dress and over it I have a floral kimono. Um, I'm also carrying my messenger bag or a black crossover bag. Paired this with the same black gladiator sandals that I had before. Um, I think this is just an easy outfit that you can throw on. Um, it's very comfortable and again, I happen to have another color in this dress, a army green color. So again, if I like something, I like to own a lot of it and that's kind of like my downfall with clothes. So that sums up my video for today. And I just want to tell you what I'm going to do. If you guys liked the video and enjoyed it, please don't forget to like, comment, and definitely subscribe for more videos in the future. And see you guys next time. Peace.